on, guys? Okay, so I don't have Miles here with me because he's upstairs, obviously. And I'm just doing this really quick. I'm just doing the intro because this is the other half of Chantel and Pedro, okay? Full disclosure. I could have chopped it up and made it seem or like just do it like behind your back. But I also am wearing the same clothes and stuff, but I still am wearing the same clothes, so I totally could have done it, but full transparency, okay? I think having, it was a way too long of a video. So having like a 22 minute long video doesn't really make too much sense. Plus you get a free one now on Saturday. I usually do Poppy Code, and Poppy Code is coming out today, later today. Check that out if you haven't checked it out before. It's where I give really, really good advice. I answer all these types of questions. Anything. I answer anything and everything. Sometimes it gets deep, sometimes it doesn't. That's coming out later. So I thought I'd just make this intro really quick because I don't have another one. I could have redid it, just copy and paste the intro from yesterday and put it on. I wonder who would have noticed. I should have done it. That'd be funny. Is it going to fit in the trunk? I got it. Whoa, go inside. The trip to the Dominican Republic made everything worse. Now my family's even more suspicious of Pedro and his family. And things are a little more tense between Pedro and I, especially with money. I work at a nursing home and I'm going to nursing school and Pedro's working too, but we haven't been able to save any money. I need to know why you haven't been able to save money. Where'd you get that 50 inch from? Maybe, who paid for the weddings? Where's your, where's your money going, Chanel? Chantel, what's her name? Pedro with titties? It doesn't even fit. I do it, baby, no worry, gotcha. It doesn't help our financial situation that Pedro sending money home has gotten out of control. It seems like the more money he makes, the more he feels that he needs to send back. To me, that doesn't make sense because I would never fucking do that. Is Pedro trying to adopt a bald, uh, chunky man from Illinois? You don't have to adopt me. Uh, PayPal, right here, monthly. Weekly, however much you want to give me, bro, just give me everything TLC gives you. They fucking owe me. Baby, why do we have to send the television? Couldn't we send something else? You're shipping a television? I'm scared shipping t-shirts because they're going to break. I promise to my mom I need to send that television to she, baby. Okay, I get you promise to send a television. That's super nice of you. Fantastic. Great. Mm, perfect sun. Okay. 50 inches, though. I don't have a 50 inch TV anywhere in the house. It's not your problem, it's my television. I put my money there. I worked so hard for saving that money, baby. It hurts my feelings when Pedro says that it's his money because I feel like it really is our money. Yeah, true. Also, what does your mom need a TV for? I feel like you could use the money on something else beneficial aside from a TV. Is that a fucking necessity, Pedro? Every time when calling my mother, she asking, where are my television? If my mom, every time me and her got on the phone, was like, where my television? I would hang up and I would block her number. I used to sell money home because I never had a father. He left when Mrs. Young. So now I feel like protect and provider for my mother and my sister. Do they not have a currency there? Do they, do they not work at all? What's, what the fuck's going on here? Hello, how are you guys doing Hi. today? Oh, we're doing great. Can you, can we ship this? Hi. Oh, we have a big package for you. Oh, yeah. Where are you shipping it to? Um, it's going to the Dominican Republic. Republic. It's got a, quite a distance to go. I cannot wait to see how much this fucking costs to ship. Because shipping t-shirts internationally almost gave me a heart attack. So we'd want to put it in other packaging, you know, maybe another box. Do you want to ship it? Yeah. What are you going to do, walk it there? Fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I feel like the money could be spent on something that we actually need. Like what? What do you need, okay? They need a TV. You don't need fucking food. They can eat steaks in the Dominican Republic. You can eat ramen, bitch. We're a new couple starting out. We need to really be on point with what we're spending. Wow, it's huge. I'm so glad that that's the first time I've ever heard a woman say that. And it wasn't to me, but I'm going to pretend like it was. Now, we did have to add a couple inches to it. How much would it be? I'm pulsing. My heartbeat is through the fucking roof. It's going to cost $1,053. No. $1,053. No.
I almost, I almost shed a tear. Oh my, I'm gonna cry. Holy fuck! I literally, I did not even think it was in the realm of close to a thousand dollars. Get fucked. You're telling me they couldn't tell you the price before they put all the little shit on it and wrapped it up? Oh my god. $1,000 for a whole thing. That TV didn't cost anywhere near $1,000. Not even half. Oh gosh. What are you gonna do? Probably throw up. I would have fought the person checking me out. Sometimes me, I understand. They promise I'm my mom. I need to send that television. This is the fucking dumbest thing I've ever watched in my entire life. I guess he's becoming a real American, huh? Caring so much about TV? Hmm. I don't know why you are just stuck on sending this TV. Just send $300 to your mom and she can buy a brand new television there. Told you it was less than half. And very good point. Like, obviously Pedro's a fucking idiot. And so are you. You, you can't t get through to him with super objective and realistic? Christ. Okay, I wanna cancel. I, I know what I'm saying. I mean, we did kind of get it all packaged up. <clears throat> Excuse me? I will, I will walk the fuck out of here with the cardboard wrapped around my TV. What the fuck did you just say to me? <clears throat> oh my God. So we are just gonna pay for a box and go home? This is ridiculous. <laughs> Yeah, it's ridiculous. I know. I'm glad that he came to his senses about not shipping the television, but when Pedro's mom and sister find out that he's not sending the television, I know they'll be so mad. I would honestly never talk to that person if they sent the TV for over $1,000. I don't care who you are. Mom, the Pope, Miles, you're out of my life. How much is the package? $58.85. Yeah. His family is so ungrateful and they just want more, more, more money. And I really don't want this to carry on for the rest of our lives. Sounds like you should get a fucking divorce then, tits. I'm, I'm still debating in post-production if I just want to zoom in on her breasts the entire time. I guess you guys will know. Wow, that was incredibly lackluster. All we did was talk about TV. I had no idea what's going on. Shit! Thank you guys so much for watching. Okay, I'm gonna end it right there. This is weird to do because I'm filming the outro even though I didn't film anything in between it. Roll that fucking Twitch clip, bitch! Monday through Friday, uh, 8 p.m. to uh, 1 o'clock in the morning. Central time. Mm -hmm. I think we're oh. able to eat jello that long. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, Sam. Taking down Soldier and McCree. Holy fuck. Oh shit, Genji. Oh, <laughs> never mind. Give me Genji, thank you. I was chasing him for a good 10 seconds. God damn. Oh.